Hello, people. It is me. I'm beginning back. This is Let's Play Tactics Ogre. Let us cling together. Eh, for the PSP. It's so day 15 of white scale, and we're heading to Tiny Mouth Hill. Oh, dear. Okay. Let's retreat from the battle first. And let's really head to Tiny Mouth Hill. And we could deploy 10 of us, and we shall do so. So let's move our hero to the backspace. There's been a couple... I've done this for a couple of tries already. It's 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 quite a... It's not really as easy as um, some of the other quests. Let me see, let me think. I want my here, here, uh, my mage is here and here. Uh, I want you here. And I want you kind of there. Um, you think that's it? No, I probably want Dogi like here. My wall crusher. Alright. Let's use this battle party. Let's wait down the hill. We're gonna meet Lancelot finally. Yes. That's odd. There's no one here. Strange. Perhaps they've already um, joined the others at Sanji Wheel. Hmm. Wait a second. What? Impossible! Good to see you again, Biggie. And looking so well. <laughs> I worried some second rate headhunter had done for you. What are you doing here? The Holy Knight Lancelot. Where is he? Boys, what business have you here? I thought you were in the Sunji world. And I thought you dead, Arizel. Guess we were both wrong. They say you ignored Lena's orders and she's down Biggie. But this? So, that's the way of it. Turn traitor, have you? For woman, you choose the losing side. I choose no side until I have judged for myself who the traitors among us truly are. What are you doing here, Vice? Where's Lancelot? <laughs> All these years, and still you surprise me. I did not think false whispers would lure you so easily. Your Zenobian's not here. No doubt, he's in rhyme by now, deep in his cups. <gasps> Sorry, you won't be joining them. But you die here. Duke's orders, none with eyes at Bama Musa, are to live. What? You too, Arisel. If the truth were to get out, it would be no end of trouble. Y you were at Bama Musa, Vice? Aye, that I was, with your beloved Lena, no less. So, wait. You know nothing of what has planned? Not a word? Lena must be mad! Only a lunatic would pay the price for victory! Pity you learned the truth, girl. There'll be no reconciling with Lena now. You're not the one to look the other way. Oh, whistle. Kill them all. Spare no one. There it is. Our objective? Vanquish Vice. Which is quite problematic. Let's go on to battle. A life spent hiding from soldiers brings back his old times, eh? After the Dark Knight attacks Goliath, we three hid in a deserted house near the church, waiting for the back room to withdraw. Our stomachs are empty. Our hearts filled with fear. They would discover us. You swore you would never live like that again, Catua. Your point eludes me. It's not too late, Catua. Come with me. I can have you spared with a word. Whereas following Biggie led you, always running, always hiding, it wearies you. I see it in your eyes. Wouldn't you rather walk in the light? Shadow, light, I care not. My only wish is to stand Biggie's side. Oh dear. She's got it in deep, folks. Well, things could change. First of all, let's give him a little bit of a rock reception <laughs> there we go vice call off your men there's no need for this 
You disobeyed orders at your own peril, traitors. Orders? That was a call to slaughter innocents. What man could do that? This man could. Are you unable to see it, Biggie? History will show that our countrymen's sacrifice built our future anew. Weiss, what's happened to you? Oh dear. I'm gonna move somewhere around here. So we'll stop um, Aricel from running right into danger. It's perfect for us to attack Vice. There we go. Get attacked by this dragon, though, unfortunately. Ow! That is not ideal. There are many Omorika who, as I said, blind to the truth of Amamusa. Will you go and deceive them? How long can you carry on such deception? As long as I need be, if we are careful. These people can know nothing, care nothing for the truth. They need only stories to convince themselves it's true. You're wrong! Tr tr without truth, we are lost! When Biggie told me that told you the truth, were you quick to believe him? We are not cling to Leonard's tale. Let us now. You believe only what you want to believe. Oh. Right. And you... Yes! You move back, finally. Do you feel nothing, Vice? How can you look upon the wreckage of Amamusa and not weep with shame? We have known each other since we were children. How can you lift your sword against a friend? Because I know what I do is right. Catch you up. I am no murderer, but this is war. We are not playing at soldiers anymore. Am I not content to sit around grousing about injustice when I, the means to end the suffering is within my grasp? As you end the suffering of so many of your countrymen in Baba Musa, I see you place all the evils of war at my door. Tell me, what would you have done if Biggie in heated Baba Musa? Lena, a bit heated Lena, needed heated the Duke's order in Baba Musa. What if he chose to die as I did? What then? No, stay your answer. I already know. Readily would have you joined in the slaughter. Am I wrong, Ketchua? Never. He'd, he'd never. All right, all right. I think it's time we uh, use our lobber. Look at that. Look at how it deals with height. Excellent. Oh, um, that was a Dragoon, by the way, if you didn't notice. Yep, a Dragoon. And we'll need her. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Need her, yeah. And here comes Catapus with an arrow to the face of Vice. 100 percentage. Uh, not a lot of damage, though. Unfortunate. Oh, that's not good. You have to keep uh, Biggie on his to toes at least until uh, Vice comes into you know comes into play in, in his next turn. Uh oh, he's she's using Mendley. The female dragoon sprite, uh, the normal sprite, is uh, is atrocious looking, but I do feel that her. Uh, uh, like, you know, facial sprite. It's actually alright. It's not that bad. Not that bad looking at all. Okay. Bombed. Nice. And Dogi could very well cast stone. Yup. <laughs> And our Terranite, can you do something yet? No. And we get killed. All part of the plan, folks. All part of the plan. Oh, don't hit me. Don't hit my corpse. What? Oh, it's his second turn. Oh, dear. And we move over here. And we pull the blow, Vice. Yep, with this battle, the only two things that I'm concerned about, of course, is uh, keeping um, Aricel alive. So I throw myself in to sacrifice myself. Otherwise, everybody's going to hit um, Aricel, including Vice. And it doesn't really matter if I win or lose this, well, if I die or not. And the second thing I'm worried about this battle, of course, is there's a Dragoon in the top left. 
Um, okay, let's see. Okay, the dragon's in the way. So I could instill light on one of these guys. Probably Cloud. No, Canopus. So, <clears throat> so now he's light touched. Excellent. And our mage. I see you moving this way. And you can word of pain uh, this uh, little guy here. So let's do that. Wait a minute. And meditate. And you could uh, acid rain. Word of pain, acid rain. Here's some methane. Some pain. Nice. Okay. Oh. Well, at least she's out of danger. But here's my main bit of damage. There we go. Lubbers. Oh. It's Bomberman time. 67. Yes. Boom. Uh-oh. Oh, he's using Mental Leaf. Phew. And Canopus could come right here and steal the show by attacking with a plus one battle axe. Boom! Is that enough to have him retreat? Not quite yet. But here is some heavy axe action. Ah, oh, Dogi, you're way behind. But this will definitely end it. Wow. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay. Should I risk it a bit more, or? Hmm. My turn's not up yet, and I do still have the Griffin. Nah. Let's just end the battle. This have gone better. We withdraw for now. No going back to Assistant Biggie. Your route is cut off. There's nowhere to run. Uh-oh. So what does that mean for us now? Oh, it means that our, our route is cut off. You flee? Fox, you coward! I'll chase you to the ends of the earth. you never escape what you did in Baba Musa. Ugh. Biggie. You are right. I owe you an apology. My life, my remains, your my life, my life remains yours to do as you will. We just withdraw before they receive reinforcements. Fall back to Chrysero. Oh yes, thirteen minutes. Well, it's more like fourteen. But we yes, we got three dragoon marks, which is awesome. Oh, let's see here. Archers gone up. Rune fencers. Berserkers need the levels. My ninja's gone up to six, which is good. And all around, yeah, that's awesome. Awesome. Yes. Got some skill points being distributed. That's fine. Arisa wants to join the party, so let's have her join the party. And that's the end of that quest. Oh. And one thing I figured out as well is if you go to the Wheel of Fortune, not the Wheel of Fortune, go to the talks. Porumpa is open to hunting. So Duke Runway has decreed that the Porumpa Wildwood, which has long been neglected due to the war, is open for hunters. Hunting will be limited to the southern tracks before Tenemuth, other areas are to follow. Whilst they are growing in power, but they yet lack the funds, it is though they seek profits from Promphar's beautiful reserves. Yeah. Excellent. So once you've read that, Promphara Wildwood opens up as an area. Uh, but I think first we're going to head to Chrysaro, like, for the next battle. But 
As they say, yeah. Uh, it's time for us to take a rest. After that, uh, bit. Oh, yeah, I didn't say it once. Um, <clears throat> it's a trap! But yeah, it's me, I'm B, and I'll be back.